research, in engineering, in manufacturing skill, in the values that bring a better, more satisfying life at General Electric. Progress is our most important. Basic knobs. This knob here is the alarm off and on knob for your General Electric. And this here is your volume knob. Turn it left to low, or the volume, or turn it right to enhance the volume. This one's your channel tuner. Yes. Tune to your favorite station. Let's listen to these tubes hum. There we go. It's an AM only radio for this General Electric alarm clock model. Let's see, we can turn off the radio, we can set it to alarm, we can put it on auto, and this one here, let's turn it up a bit, let's turn it down, left, and this one to shut off completely is line up the off button, and there you have it, taking off and putting on the back panel. Let's turn this unit around. Here we go. And you take this back panel off. So we got a pull here and here. These two on the bottom just slide out. The two on top pull out, and the two on the bottom slide out. Wedge your fingers in a bit, but keep in mind this is a very delicate plastic. Now we got to pull the power cord out. There we go. We don't want this on or even plugged into the wall while we're working on this. Keep that in mind. Now as we took it off, you've successfully done. Let's put it back on. Put the two bottom parts here and here into the slots. There we go. Now lift this little dial on the bottom. And plug in the power to the unit. Don't plug it into the wall. Just connect the power cord on this by pushing it in gently. Now, as we took it off, lift the plastic lightly, and the case, there you go, slide it in, and the backing is on. Everything's secure, now let's turn it around, see what you've done. Successful. Congratulations to you. Examining the inner workings. Let's look at this machine and turn it around. I took off the back panel already. Now, this is the chassis inside with tubes, yes, vacuum tubes. Now keep in mind this chassis, the knob is held in with a metal bracket like gasket on it. So do not pull it out from the front. Hold under the front knob and hold under the case back and forth by pulling on the chassis with the tubes. Now this may take a while. I have my thumb on a little transformer and my other hands underneath and just pulling and wedging it out. It may be stuck due to dust or grease. A few minutes later, after a lot of effort, you can gently pull out your chassis, like so. Now keep in mind that if your chassis or radio is not working completely, your tube may be out or it's time to replace those old transistors and resistors. Let's look inside and see what the internal workings are. Yep, all the tubes look good. Now don't forget to get your tube tester out and test the tubes. It's always good to test them if the radio is not working properly. One goes out and the other ones are all good for nothing. There we go, the back paneling. How to set your clock. First, pull the knob to set the time with the black hand. Second, sending the alarm, push in the knob. And you can set the red hand to the right timing for your alarm. Now with this model, let's see. Yep, let's pull it out. Turn it around and make sure we can only change the hour hand and the minute hand. There we go, turning it around. Now let's set it to, oh, let's say, a little past 12. There we go. Now let's take and push in the knob right here. Push. And we got it. 
Now let's change the red hand so that we can change the alarm time. No longer for 7, but let's change it to 12. Keep in mind that the knobs might switch back and forth, so keep your eye on which hands are moving. Now this one, the bottom left knob that I'm turning, is to set the alarm for the snooze time. It'll take up to 60 seconds or 5 seconds. And the button up here, the little one sticking out, is the snooze button. So let's set the alarm, leave it a bit. Yeah, move the other hands. And the alarm should go off. If it doesn't go off like it did right now, that means you need to check the alarm and clean it out. Or your alarm may no longer be of use. This has been your host from Tech one Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please select like below. And don't forget to comment.